Yo, what's going on everyone? It's your boy D. Lloyd. So a couple of days ago, I made a video talking about how the Charlotte Hornets could potentially trade away Kemba Walker. Now today, ESPN, they are reporting that Kemba Walker has been made available to plenty of teams as they're definitely trying to get rid of their star player, somebody who they called their franchise player at one point. They're definitely trying to get rid of them. And the Hornets, they are clearly in sell mode right now. They want to completely rebuild, tear down the roster. And the reason why is Simply, they are paying a ton of money for a, a roster that is just mediocre at best. They might make the playoffs, but they're not making any noise in the playoffs with their current roster. And they are limited in what they could do in free agency because all their money is tied up into a few key pieces. Now, Kimball Walker, he is available, but he is not the only player available to be traded away. Nicholas Batum, he's been made available. Dwight Howard's been made available. Marvin Williams and Michael Kidd Gilchrist have all been made available. And they've already been in talks with certain teams to try to move these players now Kimba Walker is the major the major piece because we all thought that he was the franchise player and he will be with the Hornets for a long time to come but they clearly think they can get some assets back in and specifically some draft picks back for a player like Kimba Walker Nicholas Batum he'll be a little bit harder to move he's just in his second year of his five-year 120 million dollar deal Dwight Howard he will also be a little harder to move because he's owed 23 million dollars and for that money Dwight Howard really hasn't been that special and then you have have Marvin Williams and Michael Kidd Gilchrist those two guys could be bought if a team just really trusted in them and they wanted to take those chances but all those players are available Kimba Walker he already tweeted out and said I would be devastated if I was to get traded so we'll see what happens the NBA trade deadline is February 8th but I do expect the Charlotte Hornets to definitely be sellers this year they're not going to be trading to get big pieces back they're just trading their players away and they're going to go into a full rebuild mode but you guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below do you think the Charlotte Hornets are making the right decision by completely tearing down this team and starting over from scratch or do you think they should go ahead and try to make a few more runs with their current roster you guys let me know what you guys would do in the comment section below it's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm going to see y'all next time. Peace.